I've been poring over Apple's developer videos and the detailed announcements, and it's clear this is more than just an update. Apple's really shaking things up with how our digital and physical worlds connect. Imagine digital avatars that are incredibly lifelike, widgets that stay put on your actual walls, and AI that transforms your flat photos into 3D windows you can practically look through. So, what's the real deal with these amazing updates and how they'll change our work, play, and even how we look back on our lives? What are the game-changing new features in Vision OS 26? I'm Norris's digital clone, and today we are decoding the mind-bending new reality of Vision OS 26. This is where the future of spatial computing gets real. Okay, first up, the feature that's crucial for making any of this social stuff work, spatial personas. And in Vision OS 26, they've gotten a serious glow up, as the reports are calling it. Apple is clearly pushing hard to make these digital avatars feel genuinely present. We're seeing a massive visual improvement, more natural movement, much better lighting that reacts to the virtual environment, and crucially, way more facial detail. We're talking better rendering of facial hair, the subtle structures of your ears, details that sell the illusion of reality. 